Hi guys, welcome back to Objada. So in the previous one, we saw how to implement Uno CSS in uh, Svelte Kit. And also I showed you how it can be a replacement for Tailwind or Windy or Bootstrap, a framework similar to that. Uh, now, one thing I haven't discussed is uh, Svelte has this use case of uh, class directives. So that is not taken care by default. Uh, let's imagine, I'll just uh, remove these things. I will add the button at the bottom and I will add a top margin of some maybe 10 is enough yeah now let's say we give a color to this uh, logo and text um, something like text green 500 okay so that will apply right away and uh, let's say instead of that I have a class directive where I will add purple color if this is true so if you have if you are not sure of uh, you know what class directives are I have a video on that maybe I will leave a link in the description now uh, only if it is true then this will become purple and if we look at the DOM here it actually has text purple finder but the style isn't present now in order to make it work uh, there is there is a there is a documentation particularly for Svelte so let's go there yeah Svelte kit so here uh, this extractor Svelte this is what we need so we have to go here and get that and then use that inside oh, no, see, that's the only change you have this extractor property with extractor swelt in it it should uh, start working uh, i may have to restart the server one more time let's come back here and it's showing the color and when i hover the color changes now this can also happen now it is you know automatically true let's say we programmatically make it true so let's say i have a script tag and then i have let change color equals false and this depends on change color okay and uh, maybe on click the button here uh, we'll change that color now uh, we'll we'll make it true change color equals true so it becomes true when we click this button so all right now instead of purple i'll have it's already present so i'll have something more green again which is not present so now uh it is you know it is black in color and when i submit it becomes green so uh, where wherever you use class directives if you have that extractor uh, it will start working as usual so that was it for this one guys i'll see you in the next one bye bye